Cal. We'll go straight to questions for Griffin. Griffin, to bounce back from that joint uh, on the extra point, can you just talk about what's going on through your head running onto the field? You know, I didn't really think too much running on, onto the field, but uh, I'm glad that I could kind of bounce back after the one, doing off the extra point off the upright. Um, yeah, I'm glad and blessed that I went through on the field goal. So. How, how hard is it kicking you guys with the bazooka tag and you got to run out there? I guess how hard is it to really just loud and make sure you just, you know, you're lined up to kick? I mean, I practice it every Thursday. You know, we're kind of we're ready for it, you know. Uh, those teams coach, uh, Tom Riddall, he uh, harps on us a bunch about doing it. You know, we do it every Thursday, so. It's just kind of routine, you know. You go, you can go out there and like not think too much, you know. Just come back to your technique, you know. Kick so many balls, so I just kind of go out there and kick it. Nice. Is there a specific hash you wanted on for that situation? Not really. I tell him just put it anywhere. Just give me a chance. Max said as he was running off and you were running on, he knew you were going to kick it. What's it mean to you to know that your teammates have that kind of confidence that you're going to go out there and make that kind of kick? It's a blessing because you know a lot of a lot of teammates, you know. That's why this is a great group of guys, um, you know, so going out there knowing that they all trust me and having that, you know, confidence, and they give me the confidence to go out there and make the kick, so it's, it helps a lot. You know, when a game is kind of going in this direction, starting after halftime when you're trailing, but there's never really any distance between the two teams, is it starting to kind of get into the back of your head that you might have to go out there and make the kick late? A little bit, you know, always kind of stay in the net, being ready, you know. Um, we know every game can come down to a kick, so... You know, after I kick one extra point or something like that, I just kind of move on to the next kick. So that kind of helps, like, you know, make a field goal next kick. So uh, I'm glad Max, that. Oh, sorry. There you go. Max said that you knew you were going to make the kick. He had a lot of confidence in you. What does it feel like knowing that your teammates have that kind of confidence in you as a player? I mean, it's a blessing, like I said. I mean, it's pretty important, you know, to me. They give me the confidence to go out there and kick. So I'm super blessed to have their support, and they give me confidence. It kind of, like I said, it kind of comes back to just, you know, doing it every Thursday, you know, like you kind of prepare yourself for that moment, you know, like that's what you want as a kicker, you know, so you can you know, help your team win. So that's, I don't really think too much, you know, I do it all the time. So. Were you able to kind of stay in your normal mm -hmm. routine? Yep, I was, I was ready. When you all do it on Thursday, you'll do it like in the practice, beginning, middle, kind of whatever it is. Like. Middle practice, you know, kind of the beginning, I'd say, I'd say. What, what is it like when you guys practice? Like, how, how well do you guys like, put the execution? Uh, I mean, we practice it every Thursday, like I said. I mean, it's, I mean, we execute it pretty good, you know. We do it all the time, so there's not really anything that you could, like, mess up. I mean, I guess you could mess it up missing the kick, but, you know, we're, uh, we're used to it, you know. In some ways, it's a really easier to kick in that situation because you don't have time to think about it. You get it. Yeah, like, I didn't even know we were doing bazooka, and so I heard it. So I'm like, <laughs> I run out there, you know. So I didn't really have to think about that, but, um, yeah, so we were blessed it went in. Were you surprised that Baylor didn't try to freeze you at all? I don't, I don't really think about it. You know, Tom Riddell asked me like two weeks ago, he goes, uh, do you, are you going to focus on how many timeouts they have? And I'm like, no, I'm just going to go out there and kick, you know. So. You know, two more for Griffin. You work with Jay Noble from, don't you? What's that relationship like, and, and how has he helped you maybe get prepared? Uh, yeah, we're, we're very close. You know, we fish together, helped me kicking, you know, got me to where I am today. You know, I'm super blessed to have him in my life. You know, he, he killed it when he was here. He made a lot of big-time kicks. So, uh, yeah, he's a really close friend, and he's helped me. You know, I give him the give him so, most of the credit for this kick. So, Leo, what were you doing? I was kind of walking to get ready for the field goal because it was, it was third down. We didn't get it. So, I was going to be ready to like, just kind of trot out there, and it just, just went out there. So. Thanks, Griffin. Thanks, Thank you.